Now that you guys know how to set up Visual Studio for a project, I'm going to show you how to do something really simple, just open an image. So if you haven't seen my tutorial on how to set up um, Visual Studio to use the OpenCV libraries, please click on the link below. Um, set it up first and then go ahead and watch this tutorial. So for this tutorial, I've named the, the project Displaying Image Tutorial. You can name it whatever you want. Um, here you add a new item. And this is going to be your C++ file, and you can name it anything, but I'm going to name it the same thing. Displaying image tutorial. And it saves right where the folder that you created for this, or that was created for this, gets saved. Alright, so I already have um, an image in mind and the code set up for you. So I'll go to my desktop. Uh, this is the image that I want to open. It's called Darwin's Fights. And if you hover over it, it tells you that it's a JPEG. And here is the code I have. So I'm going to copy and paste in here. And here you can see that you've included the high GUI from OpenCV. And it opens an image saved in a specified location. And you can press any key to close the image window. And uh, so I've left this blank so I can show you guys how to fill this in. So as you saw, the image was located on my desktop. But what you can do is right click, go to properties, and it'll tell you the location. So copy that, place it right inside a uh, CV load image. And what you have to do here is you have to put um, another slash, another backslash. And then you're not done. You have to put the name of the file. So mine is called Darwin's Fight.jpg. So make sure to save that. Then you can just debug. And there you go, there's your image. Uh, you can play with the window size, but for now that's that's good enough to show you guys how to open an image. And since the code specifies that you can close the window using any key, I'm just gonna press F. And there you go, it closed.